Well, new at 10, there is a job out there where you can help improve people's lives, even help them have a successful surgery. You don't have to be a doctor or you don't even have to have a four year degree. John Rogers has a look at a job that's in demand right here in the Valley. Jesse Austin worked several careers over the years from meat cutter to masonry to working outdoors. He started looking for a new career when the economy hit a slump. Once I heard that they were getting into the medical field, I felt like that was a real secure area to be in and just wanted to, to jump in on that and be a, be a part of that growth. He works at Cadence in Verona, helping make tools doctors use in surgery. It's a field known as mechatronics, which combines electronics and mechanical engineering. I tell them that you know, where I'm at is, is steadily growing. It's, it's grown more than any other company I've seen in this area at all. Um, it's if you want a good more than just a job, if you want a career that I feel like this is a good place to to get settled into. As the equipment has been more and more automated and computer controlled, uh, we highly covet the electromechanical technician. Tom Nelly is Cadence's vice president of manufacturing. We're growing more than just in Virginia but at other sites as well. Um, as our technology and our equipment gets more and more precise and more and more automated uh, the demand for the electromechanical electro technicians is going to continue to grow. And we're growing almost double digit pace. Economic statistics gathered by the Shenandoah Valley Partnership reflect the average wage in our region for this position is more than $42,000 per year. There will be a need for 374 positions over the next decade in the Valley. These positions typically require a one year post secondary or two year associate's degree plus on the job training. We covet those who already have those skills or already have that training coming in the door, but many we bring in with the general foundation that we can train and build up and they can go and get their training uh, later for promotion and advancement within the company. They're building products to help improve or even save lives. It's a good feeling knowing that you, you're part of something that's been um, successfully used and making a good outcome for a patient somewhere. And that was John Rogers reporting. Now you can find other jobs that are in demand where we have a special section on our website, whsv.com. Check it out on your smartphone, tablet, or computer. Just look for In Demand.